The overall goal of this analytical method is to measure the amount of hydrogen sulfide present in the headspace above crude oil samples or the amount dissolved in the samples themselves using gas chromatography. This method can help improve the upgrading and handling of heavy crude oil as hydrogen sulfide is toxic and when dissolved in crude oil can deactivate catalysts and be corrosive. The main advantage of this technique is that hydrogen sulfide is determined in a single step with no interference from other hydrocarbons present in the sample. To begin, open a Dean Switch calculator program on a computer and input the column dimensions, carrier gas, temperature, desired flow rates, and detectors used. The calculator will define the pressures needed for the inlet and pressure control module, or PCM, and the length of restrictor tubing needed for installation between the Dean switch and the flame ionization detector, or FID. Note these pressures and input them into the method file. To install the column, ensure that the instrument, oven, and inlet are at room temperature. Turn off the gas flow to the inlet and PCM supplying flow to the Dean switch. Following the manufacturer's instructions, install the dimethyl polysiloxane column between the split, splitless inlet and the Dean switch. Then install the plot column between the Dean switch and the sulfur chemiluminescence detector. Finally, install the restrictor tubing between the Dean switch and the FID. The Dean switch is controlled by a valve in the gas chromatograph. 